This is one of those builds that is so strong when you can see the enemy team and you know they're going to want to run around you, outplay you, maybe even brawl you. Outrage Dragonite, I think, is all the rage right now because so many things don't want to get stunned in a, like, face-to-face -face confrontation. This is me playing it, not only double stacking, because I just wanted to do that for fun, but also playing it with extreme speed. I really like this, especially when my enemies are getting crazy mobile. I think Dragon Dance is probably better overall, but extreme speed just sets up so many moments where they think they get away and you have a sure hit to lock them down again. This is Outrage Dragonite, which is a really strong counter to the meta right now. Shout out to this video's sponsor, Raycon. You know, some things are supposed to work seamlessly, like Draft in Pokemon Unite, where your last pick, instead of picking Slowbro as a defender, decides to go with Cinderace. Well, I'll tell you one thing that doesn't give you that kind of hassle. Raycon. They just work. It was a fun way to tie it together, huh? If you've been watching my channel, you know that Raycon's been a sponsor before, so you've probably heard me talk about the noise cancellation or the 32-hour battery life. I love using them to listen to my favorite podcast or stream while I'm gaming. But you may not have heard me say that these are weatherproof and sweat resistant because when you are playing Unite, you are sweating, but it won't damage your earbuds. Also, Raycon has beautiful protective cases. Uh, plus, Raycon offers a 30-day happiness guarantee, so if you don't like them, you can return them hassle-free. So if you haven't picked up a pair yet, what are you waiting for? Head on over to buyraycon.com slash spraggles. That's me to get 20 to 50% off site-wide right now. Thanks once again to Raycon for being a sponsor here. Now back to the video where I may be sweating, but I'm not hurting those earbuds, baby. Four stacks. Okay. Doing pretty good. Dang, they got Umbreon though. I'll walk away briefly. Armor Rouge, one second too late. A single armor cannon, I think, wins that whole fight. But not bad from the team. We tried. They break? Mm, maybe? They do? Yeah. Okay. I'll take my eight. That's okay. Get your jungle, buddy. Why are you here? Well, I don't even want to do this, but I don't have a choice here. I don't think I can get it in time. No, my scoring animation is not fast enough.
Okay, we scored 30. Scored 30. Why is it with 15k games on support players should carry noobs with 500 to 1,000 games? Well, you probably shouldn't, unfortunately. I mean, the reality is they, the way they pair games. Unfortunately, if you play a long time, it, like. The game doesn't reward you for playing support defender the same way it would reward you for playing a carry. Need to eat a Blissey Unite. We can Dragonite Unite down to the objective if the team goes there, but it doesn't look like they, they are going there. Nice job. Just me and you, buddy. We gotta leave. Okay. Can't get out. Snorlax and I are having some fun here. Clefable was helping too. These have been some fun fights. <clears throat> Will you ever get a 16 or reward that's not just a sticker? Yeah, probably when the China update happens, they'll change those rewards, honestly. If there was a time it was going to happen, that's what it would be. Because China, they're going to like... If we get the China update, which is like kind of what they're pitching... But, you know, nothing is certain. Um, then we would get things like that then because they'd, they'd be updating those for China, right? Hey, this is the midway point of the video where I want to let you know that I was just playing some Outraged Dragonite and I was playing a Dragonite deck in Pocket. Dragonite's everywhere these days. But, you know, it could not happen. Because it's all going to depend on whether they think they can, you know, make any money off it, right? Why did Clefable just do that? Whatever. Numbers. Let's see. Punch, punch, punch. Oh my gosh. I knew it would be fun to play this into Meowskarada, and I was right. 
Especially when he pick, picks uh, Night Slash Trailblaze. It's just, you have nothing you can do against his build. Like, Umbreon saved him a couple times, but in general, you can't do anything into this with Night Slash Trailblaze. You're just completely done. Nothing. Nothing. It's so fun. It's just like Outrage Dragonite into the right. Like it's kind of really fun in draft to see like what's on the enemy side. And you're like, oh, actually, this is going to be a great time. You know? They have a few things that mess it up. But in general, like a lot of what you see on the other side is like, this is going to be quite fun for this build. You know? Ooh, 118k too. Yikes. Yikes. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. I love you. I'll see you all next time. Mm -hmm. We did it.